It's not as hectic as it normally might seem in the, in the TV shows or the movies. Take your shoes off, polish them, go to bed at night, wake up, stand at attention. It's not, it's not really like that. Um, your time off is your time. And uh, while you're at work, you just do your job. Uh, my name is Sergeant Peters. I'm a 19 Delta Cavalry Scout. Uh, growing up at, uh, with my father in the Army was a great experience. I got to experience a lot of things I don't think other kids my age would have had a chance to do. We were raised as civilians for the most part, so when we go out, we like to, to kind of do what was normal to us, what we've grown up with. Uh, here on post, there are two 18-hole golf courses. I have fun on every time I go, it never gets old. I, they, they usually change up the greens on us. Fairways, you can never tell what's going to happen on you, and the, uh, the water's always fun. You lose a few balls there. The auto craft shop that MWR provides is appealing to me. I, I'm a car guy myself. I like to save a little bit of money and do the improvements uh, here, any modifications I might add to the vehicle. I'll also take the chance to uh, save money changing my oil. On an annual basis, I probably save up close to $1,000. I do go bowling whenever I, I can. That, that's another good uh, uh, sport to play on post. When I do go bowling, it's normally in a party of at least six. That way we can have two lanes and get a good party going. Insurance can be one of the most expensive things that you can put out in a paycheck in the civilian world. And here in the Army, it's something that you don't put out of your paycheck at all. That savings can equal hundreds of dollars, thousand dollars a year. So when one looks from the outside into the military and looks at maybe what one of us gets paid, uh, it may not seem to, uh, like much to them, uh, but you gotta take into account that what they're getting out in the civilian world, they have to put out monthly for uh, dental, medical, any kind of housing. I know that the money that I receive is for me to spend or to save. I'm definitely glad I joined. Um, there's been a lot more benefits than I originally realized even though I grew up uh, in a military family. Just having the opportunity to experience it myself is one of the, the best things I've done. I've always wanted to be in the military. I'd grown up always, you know, Halloween, I was the G.I. Joe. I'm Private James Alanis, and I'm 11 Bravo infantryman. My grandpa was a POW in World War II. He was infantry. He was captured for three years. I've really looked up to him for being in the military. It's great that I can carry on the tradition that he put forth. I grew up in wartime. I needed to serve my country. We get free room and board, and it's not like a 50-man barracks. It's just like an apartment. We have our own room. Me and my roommate share a kitchen and a bathroom, but we both have our own rooms. It is nice to have the free laundry. We have a common area where there's a big screen TV and we can just hang out, pool tables and foosball tables, and there's places outside where we can barbecue. I'm very excited that I don't live at home. My parents are pretty surprised that I get 30 days of paid vacation uh, every year. There's lots of benefits that we get. to pay for our health insurance, life insurance, our dental insurance. Since they pay for all this, my paychecks go towards me. I pay for stuff to fix up my Jeep, DVDs. My girlfriend, she's pretty expensive. <laughs> I'm the first one of my high school buddies to have a flat screen plasma TV to uh, play my Xbox 360 on. Another reason I joined was because it gave me an opportunity to pay for college myself. My friends are paying close to $60,000, $70,000 in loans, and I'm getting paid to go to college. You can earn college credit for military schools and training that you've done. I'm gonna use my college degree to help me become an officer. The Army is a big part of my future. It's already opened opportunities I wouldn't have without it. One thing I thought before I came in the Army was that all I would be doing is training and, and doing things like that would be a, able to have a family and have time. But once I've been in, I find out that there's a lot of time that is devoted for the family. 
I'm Staff Sergeant Brad Sperling. I'm a 21 Bravo combat engineer. I'm married with two kids and I live on post. My wife and I, we had our kids while I was in the Army, which was a, was a great benefit. It was very inexpensive where my sisters, you know, were spending thousands of dollars having babies and I spent $35 on one and $25 on the second one. The military hospitals that uh, my children were born in are great. They're part of my community. They, they are soldiers, so they take care of you, I think, a little better than a civilian out in the outside world. Here on post, we have on post childcare, which again is a big expense to most of my friends back home, but for me, it's not as large of an expense. We get 30 days uh, paid vacation every year. It's uh, a big quality of life issue for us that we get time with our family so that we can enjoy them. And a lot of times I'll get off work at five o'clock and that's plenty of time to go home and be able to spend the evening with the kids, you know, whether it be playing games or watching TV or just, just sitting outside. The Post has an on-post water park, and they've got all kinds of activities, the lazy rivers and the slides and the pools. So it's, it's really a great benefit because it's right here on post. You don't have to worry about it being too crowded or cost too much. Another feature we have here is the miniature golf, and it's great because it's right beside the water park, and it gets the kids out of the house. Another great thing about here on post is, is we have our own indoor pool. It's open for myself and my family, so my family can come here with me for free. My wife loves the fact that I'm in the Army because there are so many benefits. There's no mortgage payment, there's no property tax, there's no utilities. Joining the Army at 17, I'll be able to retire when I'm 37. And the day after I retire from the Army, I'll have my retirement check for the rest of my life. The Army is a huge part of my life, and my life is a huge part of the Army. Most of my friends think that I'm still in training. When I say I'm in the Army, they're like, oh, well, does your drill sergeant holler at you? And I'm like, what do you mean? I'm Specialist Faye Taylor. I'm a 37 Foxtrot Psychological Operations Specialist. I'm from Owensboro, Kentucky, from a really large family of 15. I actually had a lot of difficulty completing my degree before the Army, and I lost all my scholarships and realized I've got to get through school. A recruiter told me about the Army. The educational benefits pretty much attracted me to the Army. I talked to a lot of the counselors here on post. They directed me which way I should go, how I can get my, my education back on track. They were right there beside me, and I got my bachelor's degree. When the recruiter talked to me about the Army, I was very skeptical because I, I thought I wouldn't have a life. Most of the things that I would do, they're right here on post the water park, bowling, canoeing. We have a lake facility here. Uh, we've gone out there, barbecued, played volleyball. The fitness facilities are free to me. Really great facility. They have the latest equipment. I'm staying fit for free. I get paid to stay fit. But typically my friends, they think I'm sharing a shower head with eight other girls, and it's not like that. I have my own living space. I have my living area, kitchen area, bath area, and where I sleep. It's really nice, actually. I don't even have to pay for it. I mean, the Army pays for it. I have 100% medical coverage. I, I can go into the uh, hospital any time. I don't have to put down a deductible. I have my bachelor's degree. I have this nice job, a, a nice place to live. I have great benefits. I have money in my pocket. I'm a leader, and my, my friends look up to me, and my family, they keep telling me how proud they are of me. I'm really glad I joined.